Good morning, everyone. I am Lori Baracco. It is Monday, November 4th, and I welcome you to my weekly predictions. I have my handy dandy sage brewing here. There's a little bit of smoke, so let's let's allow this ritual of the saging, the burning of the sage and the smoke to come and cleanse your mind, body, spirit to start you off fresh and um, new, clean slate for this new upcoming week. One of the messages that I have been receiving regarding this week had to do with the winds of change. The winds of change are blowing and they're all around just about everyone these days, myself included. And um, the cards that I selected for this week through my Gilded Tarot are the Six of Pentacles reversed. Now this card talks, speaks of some of those negative actions, karma, um, greed, some of those lower frequency thoughts and or actions are kind of going to come up and there's some shifting and healing and evolving of that. It's like um, um, facing the music. So there's going to be some facing the music. You may not know all of what that's connected with, right? It could have been you were out of light six months ago and you were really frustrated and you took it out on the person in front of you and you honked your horn and so on and so forth. So so there's going to be um, kind of like an away judgment day. So um, just uh, try not to be the victim when some things randomly start happening. So it's about balancing out some of that energy and that's what that one is about. Then we have the chariot, which is, which the chariot speaks of victory and it speaks of um, some of those opposing forces, you know, just like kind of that negative um, karma, that return, that boomerang that's kind of coming back. You're going to have some healing, some closure, some shifting and like clean slate regarding that. And then I have the five of wands. This one speaks a little bit of um, kind of um, um, dealing with those internal battles and shifting the thoughts, maybe trying to help you get out of that victimhood because you might feel like, oh my gosh, I'm dodging bullets here and there and so on and so forth. But these are bullets that you have fired out into the, into the air a while ago. So... Um, Please, please, please do your best to just say, okay, it is what it is. Just let it roll off your back. Acknowledge it and say, okay, this is, I'm going to shift this. I'm going to work through this. Um, keep meditating. Keep cleansing your energy. Uh, journaling. You don't have to dissect everything. I, I, you know, I get concerned when people are trying to find out exactly when it happened and what this is connected to. Because really, um, you don't need to know everything. If you have kind of the gist of the pattern that you have had going on in your life for a while, then that kind of like covers, it blankets everything. Okay, so the wonderful thing about the winds of change is that I, I saw that a lot of messages through birds and feathers are going to be popping up. So be on the lookout for unique birds revealing themselves as well as there a few quite a few of you are going to receive some feathers as gifts. Um, I would encourage you to take those feathers and maybe um, work with air, the element of air, which is clarity, thought, enlightenment. Just put maybe put those feathers on your altar. All right, everyone, thank you for tuning in. Have a great week and just do your best to keep on going forward. Namaste.